Hello stranger, it's been a minute since we last kicked And by the way, just got in town Hello you guys, it's been a minute and YouTube world is low key been a month but reality it's only been a week. I took a break, a mental break um, after traveling and just trying to figure out where I fit in in this content creator universe but I'm back and I'm not home. I am currently back in Connecticut. If you are brand new to my channel, before we get into the details of who I am and what's going on, definitely consider subscribing to this channel. It's totally free. Comment down below, share, notification bells on. All of those things help me out here. Um, watching the whole video, um, all those good things help me out. So thank you for joining us. But I'm Amber. I currently live in the DMV area. I am from Connecticut. I'm in a long distance relationship. My boyfriend lives in Connecticut. So does my childhood friends, family. So since you're here and you're a neighbor, I come here often um, to spend time with family and friends and my boyfriend. So there's that this particular week, we're spending time with my niece. Um, there's so many birthdays so today in particular we're gonna have we're going to a birthday dinner for my friend Michelle um, that I met through my boyfriend so now we're friends and then tomorrow is another friend that I met through my boyfriend it's his birthday and we're actually hosting it here so I'm so excited um if you're not brand new do you know how it goes here when I help decorate for events like that so I'm super excited and this should be fun this should be a lot of fun but yeah i wasn't feeling too hot once i got settled in from jamaica which was amazing definitely definitely go back and watch that vlog so much fun um but i wasn't feeling it i didn't feel like picking up my camera i didn't know when i did pick up the camera what to say how to capture it i was just really lost and i actually was speaking to a friend from college yesterday we were like not talking about dming and she was just encouraging me and giving me some pointers and stuff like that so i'm just excited to get back into this all of that um we're gonna get back we're gonna talk more about that when i get more downtime because we're about to leave but yeah i am wearing one of my i don't even know if i haul this but if I did, this is definitely part of the Shein haul two-piece. Let me actually, I don't know why we're not getting some good color over here. But just a skirt two-piece and it has that faux wrap effect. Why are you guys dark? Focus. One second. There we go. Anyways. Um, it's still going dark. That is so weird. Is it because of that? yes it is good that. okay so yeah just a midi skirt um two piece so super cute ending summer on really colorful and i just pinned my hair up i'm just wearing some flat clear sandals and then one of my clear bags um with all the essentials in it money lip gloss hand sanitizer a fan uh I wanted to show you guys something I got from Walgreens really quick. So I always carry my other fan, but when I I realized that, oh, I need something like that's more convenient when I have my smaller purses. And this is not new. This is like people have seen this before. But look, it goes for your phone. So you just hook it up to your phone. And this adapts to Android, whatever Google, whatever kind of adapter you have. So let me just show you really quick. It was like six bucks at Walgreens. This is bothering me, the lighting. 
It is. But anyways, this is so cute. And it works. It actually works. So I was gonna say, does it still work when it's on like clothes? So isn't that so convenient? So I feel like I had one of these before, but I don't know. So I'm happy. And this fits right in my little purse. So I'm sure you could get this on Amazon. The scent I'm wearing, I'm not gonna lie. I forget what scent the oil is. It reminds me of, a lot of people don't know about this, but Serena Williams had a fragrance. Um, let me see, let me see if I can pull it up. Serena Williams body spray. It's definitely discontinued. It's called whatever it takes. You can pull it up on fragrancenet.com, but it's like, you're not gonna find it in stores or anything like that anymore. And I have randomly came across that at a TJ Maxx one time, I think it was like two years ago, and I was like savoring that bottle. I was like, I'm never gonna smell this again. I'm never gonna see this again. But the oil I have, the, it's like, doesn't even have a name on it. I found it, I forget where, but that's what it smells like and then i layered it with rihanna kiss body spray so we're smelling really good very warm not too warm like musky a hint of sweet i don't even know i'm not really good with <laughs> when i talk about like scents like that because i'm not like one of those designer perfume girlies because we like to save coins over here and i think body oils last longer anyways but we splurge when it's time to splurge but anyways so there's that just check it in because it's been a minute and bear with me this vlog i'm jumping back in if you know you know if you're a youtuber and you step away for just a few days it feels like it's been weeks and it really does so just bear with me it might get emotional it might not i don't know but i'm happy to be here you could bet that never gotta sweat that. 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 You could bet that never got a sweat that. Happy birthday! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday from K Pop! Happy birthday to you! Good con this is what they want to see, the real stuff. Hi! Today is something that we Hi. just want to say to our future selves. Um, <laughs> ew. Take two. What are we doing? Um, we are just, when we're looking at this years from now, know you lived, especially you. You lived, but you traveled, and you're going to continue to travel. And we're just happy people. I, I'm so glad I met you guys. You guys. I met you too. You guys make me happy. You guys love me. I can tell you guys love me, like me. Yeah. And I don't have to be anything else. Never that. Yeah, and I'm happy. Like we Bet picked like something. that first time we met. We really did. What Bet was it? <laughs> you told me that I would love it here, and you have proved it every day. Aww, it's sweet. So here I am still. We're probably married in what, 2026? <laughs> That's a solid. For real? I if can't not, wait. If not 2025, 2026. Oh, that's cute, I What the freak? It's so soon. Anyways, um, so yeah, we're just happy to be here. 
Yeah. You guys watch my journey. Have you been here since 20, what was that, 20? When did I first post my first video, 2018? You guys watch the journey. It's been a long time. And look at these amazing people in my life now. So, we've grown. We've grown. Club, you're in Connecticut. Come to K-Pot and Orange, it's so good. Great barbecue and hot pot. It's so good, like, y'all. And honestly, if you think it's gonna be not enough, it's enough. I, st I still want some donuts. Okay, I love you. That's wild. No, like. I was trying to avoid, like, rushing to this point because I wanted to start off the day, but I just finished decorating, getting dressed, and things like that. But we had so much fun last night. Um, I never did a hot pot before. I've had had Korean barbecue before. So we're going back there. I'm gonna try to find one down when I get back to DC and Maryland because it is so good. Um, really, really enjoyed ourselves. Only downside was like, you can't bring your own food there. So that's the whole thing. But today is Saturday, I'm so excited. I love like decorating and hosting an event planning kind of situation. So this was really fun. I'm glad Dave again and Lizzie let me, you know, do what I do as much, you know, as best as I can here. But before I show you all the things, this is my OOCD. So I got my little white skirt on. This top is from Amazon. It is not cropped. I just made it cropped, but it goes, you know, it goes this way. But I really just wanted it to be cropped today. I might change it, I don't know. <laughs> but, yeah, so. Um, just, and I caught myself getting ready early. Like last night when we got in, I was like clearing out the space, wiping things down, putting decor out. I should have been like putting decor up, honestly. At least blowing balloons and like, just stuff like that. But. We're ready. I'm gonna go use the bathroom really quick and then yeah. I'ma need safety. Tell her I can't snake me. Ray gun off safety. My girl's so tasty. Tell her it's your world. She wants the two-tone spaceship. Blow smoke screen daily. So the stress don't face me. I'm going. I keep it factual. I'm on sabbatical. I'm out of Central America. I need a break from hysteria. Park like the one with the carousel. I get it lit in your area. I'm locked to the vision. It couldn't be clear. You couldn't pay me to care enough. I dare you to hate me supreme with the sound through the stereo. So turn it up loud when you hearing us. We live and it's good in your area. My mama proud, she tearing up and it's going down. Got your girl aroused by these massive stacks like a hundred pounds. Running big laps till the sun is down like a hundred miles. Tinted frames on me leaning down. I'm winning now. Been a while, you ain't like me then, but how you like me now? Red one, if I hold you down, I'ma keep it there till we in the ground. Jet black when I paint the town, only blue sheets when they pay me now. I treat a setback like a step back. Wave, I got the game and advice. Alright. Oh, I, I think Daisy's gonna want me to see what she got too. Okay, I'll tell her when you open oh, that. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is that's her. That's that right there. Okay, mm -hmm. let me go get that. Mm -hmm. That was me trying to. Like, <laughs> honestly. <laughs> this is all hold you on for a little bit. From Gabi and Is it? Can I just rip it? Does that come on? I don't. Are you trying to get beat up? Should I read this out loud or am I going to cry? What's that? You can't. Read it out loud. Read the front out loud and read the inside to yourself. I'm not saying you're old, but if you were whiskey, you'd be really expensive. That'd be right. I'm expensive right now. Happy birthday, Latif. Congratulations on completing 40 rides around the sun. May the next 40 bring you uh, heart, bring your heart's desire, love, prosperity, and abundance. Mm -hmm. Oh, and thank you for letting us be a part of your life. Love you, bro. Yeah, we get your room. Oh. Damn, what do you want? <laughs> you. This feels like a baby shower. What? Yeah. Right. Ooh, ah. Oh, there's, a, a, there's an order. Dark. Okay. Yeah. The wicker chip. The yes. <laughs> <laughs> and somebody standing over you to help mitigate your pain. Yeah. <laughs> You're probably somebody get a phone call. Put up. Here's the next one. Somebody needs to break down the names. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Auntie. Mm -hmm. Ooh. See the oozing eyes. <laughs> oh shit. I don't know, I love me some whiskey. None of that is whiskey, by the way. Oh, Good. well, it came in a whiskey. Now he got it started. That's cute. <laughs> <laughs> Sound like it's a white thing. Ooh. She said, no, I like that. that. Right, right, right. Oh, oh okay. 
you have to open that right now. You. Oh, okay. <laughs> Love makes the world go round, not at all. Whiskey makes it go round twice as fast. God damn it, you're right. Very nice. Hey. Hey. Very I needed nice. some new glasses. I would say you got enough whiskey for the glasses now. Yes. Very nice. Very nice. I left all my whiskey glasses when I when I vacated oh, the Oh, duh. We going back to get the switch on. No, no, no. no, 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 no. We got to. Baby, we got what we got. Oh, we left. Oh, we left. That's fair. Y'all left what y'all left. I think they all up there. Uh, no, we, we did. <laughs> we left when we left. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you want them glasses? How bad you want them glasses? <laughs> <laughs> Mm. Bring me some whiskey socks. Oh, you, can, you, can, you can read this. Bring me some whiskey socks. Yes. Grippy socks come in handy. I love that. that. Especially after the whiskey. <laughs> gotta be stable. You know what I'm saying? Lord, I gotta make sure you're stable. Hey, Morgan. Hey. How are you doing, Morgan? Hey, friend. It's my best friend. Hey, friend. What's up, sir? <laughs> oh, I've got it. I can't. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's nice. 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 That's nice.
like that. Relax in now. We're doing brunch. <laughs> See how um, much. again. Y'all know her. Cover again. You guys know her very well. I'm celebrating my birthday today, celebrating with tea. Oh, I love it here. Hi. 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 I, look, so, look, I look like. No, no you guys look beautiful. I mean, now. you got my DM edges. No, you look amazing. Shit. You look amazing. <laughs> Sunday. Um, before we continue, I'm just trying to make sure <coughs> there's nothing wrong with my camera because I let someone touch my camera yesterday and if, I feel like they were just touching stuff and playing with it and I'm scared. So hopefully um, there's nothing wrong, but it just didn't feel right just now when I was just looking over it. But we had a really nice time yesterday. Um, everything just turned out really cool. And just very a, a really good vibe. Um, definitely at that point in our lives where you just want good company, good friendships um, surrounding you and supporting you. Especially in low moments when you want to celebrate something um, big or small. You just really want your community to be that way and yesterday felt that way to fast no rewind to the beginning of this vlog how I've been feeling um when I got back from Jamaica and kind of settled into my space I can't put my finger on it I feel lost I feel um what is the word I, I just had it I, I just feel like I'm like out of sorts and um no structure no discipline so it, it, it it's just been weighing heavy on me um as far as like my fitness journey and health journey discouraged about that because i haven't been doing my best with that the past couple of weeks but just before i left for jamaica i just felt like Dang, I, I really been trying hard. I've been trying hard. Um, and I just feel like I haven't really, I feel like I could do better, I guess, because yeah, I just feel like I could do better. I feel like um, for the results that I want in terms of that, um, I don't know, I just feel really lost. <sighs> um, no real motivation unmotivated that's what it was i'm um, really unmotivated to you know work out um make sure you know eat better when i got back um content creating took a back burner like i literally just posted something yesterday after a week or so of not, of not posting um so just very my mind my mind is frazzled so this week this last week of august i plan to do a self-care week hopefully i can um like when i have a moment i think i'm gonna curate some content around that hold on so maybe um this week i can do that um you know different a day different days for dedicating to me um definitely want to make sure i'm in the gym this week when i get back home um spending time with god is going to be so top tier for me that's going to be number one priority um and yeah just just putting the, the right things in my body that's going to be something so this is going to be a self-care week and then I'm planning on doing like a content creator, a content creators boot camp, the first full week of September. So next week, Labor like the day of Labor Day throughout that week, um, every day, just um, 
posting something that's going to be <laughs> really challenging for me because you guys know even with vlogmas i have never did it back to back to back like that so at least with this it's kind of getting me a little head start with that because it's short form easier to film easier to edit at the end of the day so i'm excited for that because i know what i'm capable of and i feel like i am holding myself back from so many great things um from things as simple as using my back camera on my phone instead of the front camera taking off a filter um be i don't know because it's crazy because with you guys i'm just so comfortable and things like that and when it comes to my phone and posting on my other platforms it's like i get shy and like i need a filter i don't like my body at this angle it's just a thing it's a thing um so i don't know if you can relate or not but this is literally how i feel um so yeah so i definitely want that to be like my, my boot camp that week so this week while I'm, I'm taking care of myself, I'm gonna make sure that I'm looking up different techniques. Like when me one day, like one of my videos might have a new edit that I never did before, a cool transition, um, a different take on the way I show you guys a lifestyle video or something like that. Um, so even something as simple as a haul, I just really wanna make sure I'm giving my all okay so that's just where my head has been um since me, my last video since the vacation video um that's just how i've been feeling <laughs> that's really just how i've been feeling um and i took a break i was like i'm gonna just feel so like out of it just pick up the camera how i usually would and honestly last weekend was really cool like um i spent time with my mom babe's mom had came up to help uh, my mom with um a vending with her vending so that was really cool because i did gift my mom a um banner for her business so it was just nice to you know put it to use and have people purchase from her and it was just nice spend time um, with family um before we traveled so it's a lot and I and I know September is gonna be a lot as well cuz I'm back and forth here and um, I know I'm not gonna be home a lot so and that's where I co create content as well hold on creating content when I'm not at home is also a struggle for me I don't know why and it's just like girl like sh be your imminent star show where you are show what you're doing show what you purchase little things like that um i have to get comfortable with that because if i plan to do this do this and i'm getting these opportunities to travel and things like that i have to take that with me um so yeah that's just just sharing that because i feel like I, I can't be the only one when it comes to that like it's so crazy every time i come here or somewhere else i'm just like Oh, what do I do with my camera? What should I do with my phone? What should I post in my story? I want to get back into posting like uh, my routine and my stories and my to-do list and making it aesthetically pleasing, um, but not thinking too much of it. You know what I mean? I don't know, guys. I'm just venting because it's been a minute and I haven't written this down. That's another thing this week: journaling, um, cracking open the mini journals I have and actually putting it to use for the rest of the year. I think will help me. Because this past year has just been a lot of different lifestyle changes. Anywho, 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 I have a little haul for you guys from Dollar Tree. I, it's been a minute because I did one of these, and I do want to put this on my Instagram as well. But I, I really enjoyed this haul that I did. I'm um, recently being in Connecticut, so I just want to share with you guys some goodies because I think these are goodies. Um, first and foremost, I had picked up these neon glow tumblers because I thought we were going to use them yesterday. Um, but they're literally just clear cups. Let me see if I can pull them out with a little glow stick around them. So, 
at you know at night these will glow i thought these were super cute and i think yeah the sticks are in here so they just fit under there so we'll save these for next time there's always like some little mini gathering and i feel like because it's gonna get cooler when we are here we can use the hot tub and have these i think this would be super super cute here um these were just some we didn't use these but these are just uh, some party a party coloring set i got all black but um first and foremost i picked this up before this sassy and chic um makeup sponge it's so cute because it's the um it, it's like a little coffee mug and tumbler the coffee tumbler and they have the other one like they had like the beige one but i was just like i feel like because i am darker skin you want to get the chocolate one so that the makeup could kind of blend with it so i don't know but you could get both you're definitely because you could just wash them but it's just so cute to um have when you're traveling so i picked up another one of these i needed some more toner so i picked up this witch hazel uh toner it's the lucky super soft brand and it's just i like to travel with this as well um if you are traveling on plane you can literally just put this in uh one of those travel containers but if you're traveling but if you're driving or taking a train or just putting it in your big suitcase this is good to travel with because um witch hazel is good for not just your skin but it's good for so many other things but um i really like this a lot and speaking of skincare, I this is my first time getting this brand, this Spa Essentials. I'm pretty sure this is a dupe for, is it Glow Recipe? Or one of those popular skincare brands. I know it's not Drunk Elephant, but it's definitely a dupe. So the first one I got is Dew. This is a Hyaluronic Acid Serum to hydrate and restore. We love that. We, we know that we need Hyaluronic Acid girlies. That's just yeah we need this i wonder if it smells like anything this one does we definitely has like a cucumber scent to it um and it, it just says apply three to five drops of the serum to clean skin am and pm you massage it in upward motions until serum is fully absorbed into skin marvel at your fresh glow and then the other one and they look so cool like i just love their packaging um and then we have glow niacinamide serum this is to brighten and tone and i feel like i don't use that enough um but this is also to like i said to tone your skin brighten dark spots things like that and you do the same thing you can apply it am and pm so and they have other ones that i didn't pick up but i just feel like these two are essential to what my skin needs um everyone's different so yeah and of course with anything test it out give your skin some time but i'm okay with stuff like that um i also picked up the be pure brand lip mask i've been waiting for this to get back into their store for quite some time because this is a really really good lip mask i really enjoy how the, this makes my lip feel um and just having it in my nightstand this is just it's really really good and you don't have to apply it just at night but it's really nice i also picked up this cute sunglass case because the other day or even when we were on vacation i was just like in my purse my my sunglasses just didn't have a home my normal glasses do but they didn't have a home and i just thought these were so cute and they had like um this is like a pinkish color but they had like a um neutral one as well and i think purple was in there but this is just so cute to me and i just love how it opens and how it looks so i got this for my purse obviously you can put normal glasses in here but my sunglasses are going to be in here. I picked up one of these shoe erasers because um, I thought I was going to be wearing my sneakers yesterday and I needed to be cleaned really, really bad. Um, but this is supposed to be you just add plenty of water to activate the sponge. On the orange side, you rub midsoles to remove dirt and grime. And on the white side, you gently buff out scuff marks and stains. So 
yeah it's supposed to be really good i guess it's just for the souls only i don't know but um let me know if you tried this before but i just thought it was just neat to have because you never know i picked up a hand soap this is just normal soft soap hand soap i picked up a be pure hand sanitizer never got a chance to get the uh touchland dupe spray hand sanitizer they have just been gone in the stores that i visited but this is eucalyptus scented and i picked this up because i really really love the eucalyptus um hand sanitizer from bath and body works so i was like let's see how theirs is so you can't go wrong with extra hand sanitizer and it's just it's not even that strong but i always make sure i have extra hand sanitizer on hand all the time and my favorite, 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 favorite find were these body sprays. So the brand is Power Stick. If you are on TikTok and you know, you know, these are the dupes for the Sol de Janeiro. Not all of the scents from Power Stick are, but these Power Sticks for her body sprays, the Brazilian Mist is supposed to be like the, the yellow Sol de Janeiro one. It smells so it smells so good, you guys. I'm mad at myself because I should have picked up two of each of these. But I feel like once they're gone, they're gone. But um, I'll make sure I go back there. And then I picked up the soft floral one. I didn't spray this one yet, but let's see. This smells so stinking good. I love it. So now I gotta go get some more. Make sure I have these. These are really, really good. Um, and they're 3.5 ounces. So are you allowed to travel with that? Or they're a little less than? Either way, these are good. Um, obviously they're body sprays. So you wanna use, you wanna layer them right because they won't last as long as you don't know, have perfume or oil. But wow, these are incredible. So. Yeah, you guys, I'm just checking in, just letting you guys know what's been up. Because, man, I, I'm i just going through it, I guess. I don't know, and I feel like I, I'm, I, I feel like within this past year, it's been happening more on and off. Like, just even besides my cycle you know being close or something like that it's just like it just hits different it's been hitting me in a really a, a wave a very deep wave of emotion so i'm trying to channel that trying to get more more centered and closer to who this version of myself is and with the losses and the new relationships in my life and things like that i just want to be better for myself and for the people that surround me so there's that i'm pretty sure today we planned on having like a cozy comfortable lazy day like with movies and stuff um we have plenty of leftovers so we just finished eating lunch but um yeah i'm just letting you i'm just checking in because you just never know what people are going through y'all so just keep me in your thoughts positively your prayers positively I already pray that God just covers me with the prayers that are for me and protects me from the prayers that are against me. But still, like, if you're for me here, definitely keep me in your thoughts and prayers. So, there's that. I hope you guys are enjoying your day. We'll do more for the black people of Mississippi than any event since we integrated the schools. I, I wouldn't even want to see 
get on baby stuff, you know what I mean? But I commend him, and every time I turn around, this girl surprises me, and she just, man, she just earns so much my all my respect, man. Amber is what. Hey guys, it is actually the next day. It's the day after um, the day I've gotten back. I started vlogging thinking I would, can, you know, show you guys me unpacking, a nice little evening routine. I did manage to create a little reel for Instagram and TikTok. Um, and then uh, my cycle started and i had to work um and just if you've been following me for at least a year now i've been battling with letting go of a friendship that i had for a very long time um a friend of my someone who I called my best friend last year things got to a breaking point pretty much this time of the year and I have been praying about it for um about seven years or so because things started getting rocky in my last relationship that I had um, with my ex-boyfriend so I was having um, issues with my best friend during that time as well so it's been years of me praying years of um, there just being issues that I feel never got resolved um, there were times where I felt like my feelings my feelings were dismissed um they didn't really matter um because we had two different ways of communicating two different ways of problem solving our issues i'm a very when something's happening i want to talk about it i want to discuss how we can move forward so that we're not allowing it to happen again and she wasn't and um that's like a recipe for disaster because with that and when you're someone like me and I, I feel like I am a people pleaser and that's gonna change but I feel like I'm a people pleaser so I'm gonna conform to your way acting like it doesn't matter anymore acting like it never happened um letting you get off what you need to get off and whatever I gotta say for me <laughs> I'm just left with it and um so last year I expressed all my feelings and it led to a breakup to me i thought it was a breakup um so it led to not speaking and something i felt like something was tugging at my spirit to rekindle the friendship again and i i, I shouldn't have here we are a year later i'm in the same space and today i had to in the friendship indefinitely um so sad because i know there are people who have friendships since they were young and i really 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 wanted this relationship to last i wanted it to be um I wanted this relationship to be just a really good one um yes there I, I wanted it to be ups and downs but I also didn't want to it to be at my expense I you know I didn't want to 
just lose myself in it and allow certain things no but I did want it to grow I wanted this to be the like the catalyst for us to be better I wanted um this person to be the godmother to my children the um my um maid of honor I know life is gonna get scary because life is scary sometimes it's not always fun um I love my boyfriend I love him I believe that's going to be my husband I believe the friends that I met through him are gonna be just my lifelong friends but as far as my person my best friend I currently don't have that anymore and I know life is going to life I don't speak sickness over my body I don't speak sickness over my siblings and my mom and my dad I don't I don't speak that but I know life can get scary so if I if I happen to lose anyone and I I we've been losing people in my family but if I happen to lose someone even closer to me until I have another friendship that I that can build to the status of a best friendship I don't have that anymore I worry that I won't have that <laughs> because um I've spoken about it I, I've spoken about it a lot and um my circle of friends now I don't need it to be huge I don't need it to be a large group of friends I'm thankful for the people in my circle right now because it feels genuine it feels like you know we know each other on a personal level I, I've been like I said before I've been in very very large groups of friends um in my 20s that just when you look back it's like mm -mm, those aren't your real friends but the friends that I have now I'm thankful for like we talk we make each other be accountable we support each other and that's another big thing for me that I felt like I wasn't getting in this friendship I didn't feel like my dreams um my aspirations were being supported I want to be a content creator I am a content creator and I want it to flourish and no one person does not change that for me like I will be what I want to be but knowing that you have a best friend and they have conditions <laughs> to when they will support you and when they won't hurts it hurts bad and it lingers for who I am I know some people they wouldn't care and they that would be automatically a boundary for them but for me I had um voiced that often and it wasn't reciprocated it wasn't acknowledged it was acknowledged in a way that it was unnecessary and silly to be brought up in a friendship and um here we are um, I don't know if I ever got that detail before but those are my reasons and if you know me personally and you know you know more details cause I'm not saying names but if you know my details cool um because this is this is my vlog this is what I choose to share I'm always going to share as much as I want to and as much as I feel comfortable to and I do feel comfortable doing that because for me this is gonna this is a video journal for me and I have a written journal that even gets more more detailed but I'm sharing it because I know there are people I didn't realize there are so many people especially at this age who go through it 
but um how it, it got to this point where it's like amber how many times are you guys gonna have the same conversation the same disagreement the same arguments and feel these feelings over and over again the stress anxiety and sadness i felt all throughout my body um my appetite changed every single time there was something um even today granted it's my first day of my cycle but it's like it's hard to eat and i don't want that for me i don't want to be surrounded by love and as much as i love this person to death this is for the better for both of us to grow and just be better people to ourselves and to other people am i perfect a perfect friend no there are there are so many areas that i can work on to be a better communicator to be a better listener to be just a better friend but i know my strong points i know i'm a good friend and i just want my next friendship on that level to be strong enough for these next steps of my life um so i had to let go and that that has to be my closure because i'm not gonna get it in the way that i think <laughs> i should get it but this is my this is the closure um so that 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 hit heavy today. I could not really vlog today, um, especially because I was really just working and just going through the motions. And I know when things like this happen, it's just God telling me he wants more of my attention. So just being intentional with reading my Bible, um, writing my thoughts and prayers down more i know there's gonna be something to show for it there already has been things to show for it so um yes i'm sad but i'm also there's peace there's peace here um i know better sleep is on the horizon um reaching my goals at a faster pace is at a horizon and that goes with youtube um my social media that goes with my weight loss journey being healthier because a lot of times when you hold on to things like that those are things that um where the weight comes from and the stress comes from and what's really holding you back from doing it and that's because you're i'm not caring anymore um so yeah, I just wanted to check in with that because that is where I'm at um, this past week. That's what's been going on too. In addition to the other couple of weeks after I got back from Jamaica, I was just, oh, I was just not myself. And it's like, usually it's like a week before my cycle starts that I'm super, super tired, unmotivated, whatever. But it was two weeks. And now my, my cycle is starting, but it's just like, I didn't like that version of me. Like, I need structure. I'm not, I'm not kind of person who needs a routine, all of that. I need that. And um, it makes me feel good. Uh, every Thursday or there's a, a day each week where I do a very deep cleaning. And when I, when I don't do that, I can't, it shows. It's like, oh, I feel different. And I know with life, it's not always going to be go with your routine, but for the most part, it will. And I feel the best. So I feel like now I can get back to myself and what I like to do. Um, it feels good here. It feels good that I now feel like the people in my life truly love me, truly support me, truly care about me. Um... And I'm going to continue to pray that God just remove anyone 
who is envious, anyone who is stagnant, anyone who is unsupportive, anyone who is just not meant to be here. That is a very scary prayer, but I'm going to continue to pr pray it because that's all I want. That is all I want in this lifetime to be able to create and share moments with the people I love. And I don't want to waste it on anything less than, you know? I will close out the vlog here because I feel like I talked a lot. Um, and I just, I, I, I need to close here and work on it. Um, I've taken a, a week off and um, I'm excited this upcoming weekend is a long weekend. Babe is coming down this weekend. I'm so excited for that. It's been a minute since he came down, since we had the opportunity for that. Um, and it's a long weekend, so I'm happy about that. And I'm also happy about next week because it's finally a week where I can have, I don't know if I'm going to do a staycation somewhere like I did last year this time or just. I don't know, maybe a more on a, on a more affordable level where I can take myself on a solo date and do things like that. But guys, y'all know September is it turns into fall for me. Um, September first, to be exact, I can take my pumpkins out. I can take my fall candles out. Well, they've been out, but they just I don't touch them. But I can take those out. We can do the fall drinks. Um, we can make them at home. We will definitely um, try a couple this season. There's spooky movie nights on the horizon. I have such a fun trip plan at the top of October. There's homecoming. There's all these different things that I'm just looking forward to. Um, and then we go into Vlogmas. So I'm just really, really excited. But just keep me in your prayers. Um, the good prayers and i love you guys so much thank you thank you thank you to those who tune in to my channel um who watch my my, my videos and you don't just click on it to give me a view you actually view it thank you to to those people you know who you are thank you to um the people who comment and who talk to me on this platform and also thank you to the upcoming influencers who are just like me and thank you to the girlies who have been giving me advice in my dms and in text messages on how on, on my content and things like that i really appreciate it i appreciate you um that's all i want to do i just want to grow I want to enjoy this. I don't want it to ever feel like a chore. So thank you so much. And um, I will see you guys next time. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel because it's free. Like the video. Comment down below. Share it. Share it. It's okay. We can all, we can all exist here um, and be great together. Okay. Can you imagine if we all were supporting each other the way we really should can you imagine how great we all could be there's a space for everybody um but yeah i love you guys so much i will see you next time bye Just say you will, will, will come to